All right. Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only. How all my adventurers doing? So I did say that I wanted to do a Conan Exiles series right after I'm done with Ghostwire Tokyo. But I kind of wanted to do like, you know, a test run just to see how many people would be filling the series. Then I would probably just do it early and just do uh, Ghostwire along with Conan and, you know, a few challenges on Elden Ring whenever they decide to fix the second phase dying bosses. But, um, yeah, <laughs> um, yeah, so I played Conan a little bit on like my Twitch streams, but I never like, you know, truly played it and finished it. That's the only issue. <laughs> like me and Shadow together, you know, kind of played it. Uh, we even made our own dedicated servers, which is you know, just now, now down and stuff like that. But it, it was actually kind of fun. Uh, so I kind of wanted to do uh, Conan once again. I, I didn't want to get into art because, you know, not a huge dinosaur fan. You know, uh, I wish Dark and Light was still going on. You know, wish the devs didn't just abandon that game. I, I definitely would have played the hell out of Dark and Light once again. But. Yeah, it doesn't really have much of a modding community and the devs is just abandoning that game. So feels bad. You know, I enjoyed the fantasy thought of it. You know, anyway, uh, this is going to be a modded playthrough. Obviously, these are all the mods that I have available. I got a few um, suggestions from people as well of which mods I should use via Discord. And I appreciate that. Uh, if you guys have a mod on here that will actually help, you know, the gameplay and stuff like that uh yeah but as you can see we have the calamitous mod which is basically factions and i think i think it's also the amber is it the amber light mod that's also magic no i think it's the calamitous that is um the magic mod because we're gonna be making vermilia and as if you guys don't know vermilia is my channel mascot and she is a mage so yeah, what what other way of just doing it the most fitting way is literal, <laughs> literal mage play. <laughs> so with that said, uh, let's get into it and I'll see you guys in game. All right. So we have a million done. <laughs> well, that's the best I can actually do for like familiar. Uh, hold on. Is there ears here? Eh, I guess that's a little bit better. Anyhow, uh, we're done with Vermilion. Um, there are different spawning areas. There's a dark forest. Uh, the starting area outside of the faction. If you do not wish to select a faction before beginning, spawn inside of the dark forest to skip the introduction. Oh, okay. So the, so the desert's going to automatically put me inside of uh, the dark forest. Okay, yeah. Then again, the faction hall will actually start me in the faction hall. Uh, we're going to start in the faction hall. So, uh, I do want it to be known that I um, don't really know... Oh. The mods have changed. Oh, I don't remember this intro. Okay, so the mod has definitely gotten some changes because I don't remember the dark forest. Now that I think about it. Oh no, not purgatory. <laughs> purgatory. <laughs> purgatory. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I don't remember this actually being a thing. This is interesting. Okay, so people are still updating their mods, dude. That's what I like to see. Hmm. Okay, cause cause back then they uh oh yeah, that's one of the mods, little server mods. I don't know why I still have that on when I can't do nothing with it. Um, I did talk to some people for out about like server settings. You know, they told me to set you know some of the stuff to to um, 3.0 
if I wanted to like actually, you know, do a series on this, it'd be a lot easier to do. And I won't like use up too much time considering I don't have too much time <laughs> anymore. Now that I'm working, uh, the hunter guild, fishing and hunting. The mining guild, uh, always looking for hardworking people, gems and valuable material. Uh, let's see, farmers sell, yeah, just harvesting resources and selling at the open market. Okay. Moonshine, gathering resources and brewing some moonshine to sell. Uh, so the wood, okay, yeah, so just wooden plants. Um, Also, this is like the actual vendor do. Well, Vermilia, uh, for lore wise, she really enjoys uh, shiny things. <laughs> That's actually why I have an emote of a treasure chest and why she looks at it. Actually, I think I have it as my uh, channel icon, actually. <laughs> That's actually uh, one of the emotes that I have for uh, Twitch that I use. Okay, faction base. I gotta remember which faction was heavily magic and actually started off with staffs. Uh, this one was more of assassins, right? Oh, so this one has a staff too, but I think I have to like go up to it. That would be my starting close. Defend the Anarius family as a knight of the cold embrace. Oh, I see. So I can use the token if I actually want to join their faction, huh? Interesting. Uh, eh, no, not that one. Not that one. Hopefully it doesn't like just process just for me touching it. Oh yeah, Vermilion is very short also. If you guys are wondering why my character is so short. <laughs> Unite under the banners of Stormhold. Stormhold, huh? I don't like your drip. Your drip isn't isn't all that good. It doesn't just scream Vanilla. That's the only thing. Ah. All right, we got an eagle. We have some barbarian looking faction going on. So this is like more of a warrior based faction. Oh, this looks, that looks familiar. Those, I think a few thralls actually Reclaim wear that. your strength as a warrior of the Van Ghoul clan. Van Ghoul, huh? That just, sounds like a vampire clan more than anything. <laughs> Van Ghoul. It's <laughs> definitely a vampire class if I ever heard it. Unravel mysteries as a scholar of Felgar. Felgar, huh? It looks like druid clothing. Ah, this, I think this area would speak more to me if I wasn't playing as Vermilion, just because of that fur collar. That I, uh, I, I say it so many times. I love armor with fur collars on them, dude. Like the, it's, it's just sick. I don't, I don't know what it is, dude. The fur collar just, just kind of kicks in, you know, like Jon Snow status. <laughs> oh. Actually, this looks closer to Vermilia. Okay, hold on. Oh. Oh yeah. Okay, we're we're probably gonna choose this one. Hold on. Let me let me figure out what this faction is. Preserve the relics of the ancient arts as a magus of Elvenor. Elvenor, huh? So I'm guessing that's mostly like elves. <laughs> Would make sense. Okay, we're going to keep this one just in case. Elvenor. I'm not going to remember these faction names. I'm just going to let you know that now. <laughs> I'm just going to let you know now. I'm probably not going to remember their names. Oh, wow. Okay, this one actually looks really nice. Oh, no, I think this is the elven one. Oh, that one actually looks kind of cool. Protect the natural order as a hunter of the Elven Covenant. 
Familia isn't really a hunter. But then again, well, actually, she is an elf. She's more of like half elf, half uh, dwarf. Okay, so, oh, it actually starts me out with a staff now. Okay, so it is basically like uh, how bows are treated. Okay. Resource mine. Okay, so that's that's my um what is it? Uh that's the thing I got from my mining job. Yeah, that's my job. So I wonder what else that they have added to the to this mod. The calamitous mod. Oh, oh, it is dark out here. Wait a minute. You guys have. What is it? Oh, you have an actual questing system now. Okay, I see you. I see you. Okay, so let's see. Um, finally, I was wondering. I was wondering where you were. There are quite a few threads nearby, so I need you to focus on everything I tell you. Survival will be key on this island. If you're injured out there, you'll need to treat your own wounds. Got it? There won't be anyone to help you. The bushes, plants nearby can be used as bandages. Okay. Receive quest. Oh. Oh, so you have a tracking? Hold on a second. sure to read through the notes I gave you. Oh, you do. I can remove them too. Interesting. Oh, they actually pop up on the side. Okay, that's actually dope. I can't see shit also. <laughs> it is very dark out here. Holy sh holy crap, it is dark out here. The hell is that? Is that a dragon? Hello? Let me let me hit this bush right quick. Oh. No, it's not a dragon. It's it's a reskin of the bat. So there's new enemies, I'm guessing. Okay. Um I can't hear anything. I mean, I can't see anything. Um Okay, I picked up some rocks. I need branches. Where can I find some branch? Oh, ah, oh, I thought that was a branch. Oh, don't tell me I have to go on the outskirts, right? Speaking of outskirts, where am I? Oh, they changed the yeah. The starting desert is is basically a uh, the new place. I wonder if I just hit, keep heading this way, will I actually go into the game? And this is just like a new area they made. Oh, just realize there's enemies here. Okay, they're friendly. They're not just like passive aggressive for no reason. They're actually just living their lives out here. Okay. I fucks with it. I fucks with not hurting me. <laughs> so these missions uh, doesn't seem like there's any rock. Well, any uh, sticks around. But then, then again, I'm supposed to be grabbing uh, resources, right? I'm going to make a branch. Well, make these. Oh, I found this quest location. Oh, there's another quest. You have not received a quest to visit this person yet. Oh, okay. So there's like chain quests. Either I finish a different person or they send me on the quest to this person. Well, I haven't found much of elevator plants here. I can actually see for once. Jesus. Feels great to be able to see inside of a dark forest, dude. <laughs> but then again, with a place called the Dark Forest, I wouldn't think it would be so dark, you know? <laughs> I'm not going back in there without a torch, Dad. That's for sure. Oh, this is another quest location. 
not what I was looking for at all. Not gonna lie to you. Oh, what the hell? Why? Why? What the heck, guys? I'm just looking for plants. Stop bullying me. What? The? Oh, you guys beat the shit out of him. You thought you could come after me? Dude, <laughs> that's so messed up. <laughs> Dude, uh, my bad. I thought it was my hood. <laughs> Oh, I found the port. This is from the river and boats mod. Well, I was say, hopefully you're not trying to attack me, right? Um, if she drops armor, I call dibs. They're probably gonna kill it. Never mind. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> smacked the shot out of that thing. Ah, finally! This is exactly what I was looking for. It just took me like ten years to find it. So why are you guys are doing that? Um, let me go ahead and make this. Okay, so I actually have to make three. Hold on. Oh, thank God I have enough. Okay. They definitely killed it. All right. Ah, now I got to do the whole run back all the way back to the, to the uh, factional. Oh, it's back again. What the heck? Um, okay. So every time I re-enter the area, that responds for some reason. Noted. Hey, dude, I got your quest done. Didn't take too long. I swear. <laughs> Only took me like 20 minutes, I swear. <laughs> okay, completed. Okay, you gave me a lot of resources. Hello again. Okay, so I gotta re-talk to him every time I turn in the quest. Um, let's see. To the north of the faction hall. Be careful. Oh, there's two of you inside of each other. Okay, that's weird. North of the faction. I don't think they mean in the faction hall because there was nobody to fight in the faction hall. Um, uh, so I guess it's. It's like north of the faction hall gates. <laughs> north of this area would have actually been a lot more clear, to be honest. But it seems like we get to try our weapon now. Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting that we do have points. <laughs> uh, let's put it into encumbrance. And... I guess grid. Just for now. Seems like my staff goes off a few resources. Did that use it? Yeah, that did. Oh. The hell? Okay, that didn't use it. I thought that was going to use like five of them. That did not. And that took forever to cast. Um. I just put push control by mistake, just to try and crouch. Um, I cannot move out of this also. You cannot cancel this. I can see that being like a very troublesome in the future. Oh, that does not go where you want it. it it's it likes it's like a grenade launcher shoot an enemy I'm definitely shooting him <laughs> oh wow so wait what was my quest got the track it again Oh, I have to skin them. Oh, well, shit. Do I have enough to make it? Yes, I do. Thank God. Let me make a axe too, just in case. I'm gonna take these crabs though. 
Come here. Whoops. I'm trying. I'm trying. Thank you. I want to see if this spell actually does more damage than I was thinking. Oh, it does a little bit. Oh, God. You do a lot of damage. It keeps me staggered. I forgot. Conan's, Conan's combat system is not the best. I forgot about that. <laughs> because you, you're you stuck in animation of most of the things you do. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. Yeah, it... Oh, it sucks. Yeah, my left click sucks. It's like a very slow projectile. And it's all floaty, too. That did no damage. Let's do... Oh, up, oh, up. Oh, yep, that's the thing. Calm down, please? Like, the fuck is wrong with you? Oh, I was, I was actually joking about the calm down thing. Okay, there you are. <laughs> I just want to see what this does. I can't see what it does. It just, it's, it's, that's not going to happen. My potion, please? Why is my potion not? God damn it. There we go. I have a feeling this tech is going to be like only good when I actually have a thrall. Oh, yeah. Uh, I was talking about it being animation hazard. Yeah, that's going to be animation hazard as long as I'm stuck in one place. So we're no longer going to use that attack. It takes too much time and wind up to it. Dude, I'm not doing any damage to this dude. <laughs> like, jeez. Oh, do all of them get crabs? Are the crabs food? I mean, it's fried crabs, so you would, you would think. But then again, I have bees to eat. And they're delicious. <laughs> oh, wait. He's not here. The hell? Did he despawn or something? I don't think he would have moved on, right? Oh, well. I forgot this was the faction hall for some reason. <laughs> oh, no, he did despawn. Okay. So, they despawn if you get too far away from him, I'm guessing? That's troublesome. Oh. Tracking down uh, artifacts, legendary creatures, etc. Time attacks most considered daily missions, which you are allowed to redo every uh, once a day. Oh. I'm guessing this is the lady we have to talk to. Hi, lady. These ruins are ancient. It's inc I have an urgent matter that needs to be attended to. Could you oh, I have. Me? To complete the dungeon first in order places like these in order to do it okay oh i have a torch that i don't i wouldn't call it a torch but it glows <laughs> if i didn't have my staff it definitely would have been like extremely dark to where i couldn't see so i probably would have had to finish that mission either way like little traps in the ground Oh, come on, really? Well. Oh god, I think I overjumped. I way overjumped. <laughs> okay, so this doesn't go out under water either. Whoops. Did these come back up? Okay, yeah, they do. Okay, maybe I shouldn't be sprinting. Maybe I should just be, you know, taking my time and walking with this. Oh, they go. They go down as soon as I get near them. Oh, I almost tried to jump that. I don't know why. I'm probably fucking stupid. That's all. <laughs> oh, no, are you kidding? Oh, dude, I was I was literally cheese out of my victory. Are you kidding me? 
Oh, this game. Dude, I thought I made it. I thought I was like, oh, dude, first first try. Well, technically, it's, it's you know, second try, but we don't count that first one. Shut up. <laughs> okay, okay. We got this. This is interesting. I'm actually impressed how much they added into this. Okay, now I should... What? What? Dude, I am being gypped. I'm being lied to. I'm being bamboozled. I'm being played like a, like a fiddle, like a good old banjo, bro. Okay, I finally made it. The game kept chipping me out of my victories. I'm just saying, dude. Like, I literally spent here for like ten minutes trying to jump this crap, and it just, it just kept, it just kept hoeing me. That, that's all you need to know. Like, is that was BS. So I wasted a lot of my time, a lot of my recording time, actually, because I, I I have to sleep for work soon, and 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 that that did not help my situation. Let's just say that. You know what's sad? I just realized that aloe vera plants actually uh spawn right here, and I I didn't realize that. Hmm. Maybe they're gonna work on like actual like quest markers you know like how far away you are from your objective something like that for like the simple things you're looking for and not like um enemies maybe there you are. who knows i at least want to get these you quests done and get and get out of here to read through the notes I gave you. always consult your notes when in doubt so i'm heading uh there is always to the next area, the area where it said I haven't received the quest for him. Apparently. I can say this, this is a neat, neat, very neat mod. Especially if you want like a huge server with like faction based combat, you know, stuff like that. That's is actually pretty neat for that. Are you guys angry at me? Okay, no, they're not very angry at me for killing them earlier. Oh, that's good. You know, at least there's no, like, faction luring type thing from what I know of right now, at least. What is this thing? Looks like I should be able to do something with it, but... I, I guess that's just there. It has a spider symbol on it. I'm hoping that this is a, a giant spider. Because I, I think the game, the vanilla game, had enough of those giant spiders, you know? <laughs> Especially the one that pitched the fit every time you, like, hit it. For some reason, it just started stomping around like like it was stomping you out. So I will say this: uh, I I've even though I played Conan before, I don't remember every exact thing of it and never checked like every single mechanic. So if you guys have any tips, do leave them down below. That would definitely help out. <laughs> we must. Okay, so we have another quest. These lands are filled with dangers. In order to survive out there you need to understand what you're up against you will have to deal with a number of hostile enemies monsters even the climate your gear is vital equip yourself with armor and weapons for a different situation when you oh you may encounter uh a good rule is to always make sure you have food and water and a light source Okay. So it wants me to skin animals, is what I'm guessing. Is key. Yeah, so it wants me to hunt a rabbit and a deer. I've seen a few deers over here. Hey, deer. How you doing? Ah, uh, well, you know. Here's a slow projectile. Oh, God. It doesn't deal half the much damage as I thought. And they're going to outrun me. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Why are you running? <laughs> oh, and I get stuck in animation. That's not going to help. Uh, oh, wow. I still missed. Oh, this is going to be terrible. Oh, it's right with that. I knew they would be coming for me. It was only a matter of time. What I didn't expect was this. 
to be crucified and left to rot on the edge of a wasteland that I have never seen before. It makes sense to me that the cowardly fools that they sent to do the job would not have the courage to kill me. They are mongrels, the cast-off bloodlines of slaves and commoners, and such as they do not dare to spill royal blood. Instead, I was bound hand, foot, and mouth, and smuggled out to God's nowhere. They left me for the vultures, and I was rescued by a man. Oh, this is the intro man, to the game. Clean limbed and bronze skinned. I have never seen his like in the cities of Shem. He came to me as I hung from the cross, and his icy blue stare was a challenge. Did I dare to live? Now I crouch at the edge of this wasteland, once a daughter of princes, now a nameless exile in an unfamiliar land. The shaft of the double-bladed axe that he gave me is a comforting weight in my hands. The answer is yes. I will live. Okay, so this isn't our character from the intro. This is the lady that we had saw in the intro. Interesting. I never actually uh, picked that up before. Okay, one deer down. Oh, that's all I needed was just one deer. Now I need to go find a rabbit, which I don't know where that is. Actually, I think I remember seeing rabbits in a vanilla game on the outside of in the normal area. Um, I may or may not have sent that alpha or ran away from an alpha and haven't fight these guys or just have these guys deal with it. Is there any loot on it? No, there isn't. But I can take its resources, though. Hey, guys. Appreciate you, appreciate you killing that for me. I really do. I say the, the bastard just started chasing me across the beach, and I was just like, oh, God. And I say I had glowing blue eyes, and I was like, oh, wait a minute. One of these mods had, like, alpha enemies. I was just like, pack leaders aggressive for no reason. Okay, <laughs> just like that, <laughs> but but those guys are just 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 jerks. That that's all it is. Oh, found a rabbit. Hold on. Oh my god! There we go. We got it. <laughs> Okay, so that quest is finally done. It only took me like 20 freaking minutes to get that. <laughs> ah, I regret trying to just finish this off first. Oh, look, there's another rabbit right there. If only that would have shown up earlier. All right, dude, we have our quest done. Wait, where are you? Oh, there you are. Hey, well, quest is done. Oh, he gave us uh, iron pickaxes. Chop wood and stone. Uh, oh, he wants us to get a hundred stone and wood. Let me track this. Oh, no, he only wants us to get 50. Ah, I see. Um, we're not going to use this. We're going to use these first. And we're done. Hopefully, I have to trade these in. Hi. Oh, I must be a member of their faction. Okay, so everybody has a different faction. I see. Do you have anything for me? Wait, quest? Oh, he gives me the stuff. Oh no. Uh dude, my inventory. In Hold sure on. To read through the notes I gave you. Okay, there we go. We're good. <laughs> Welcome Thanks. Back. Uh, construct. Three stone. Okay. We can do that. Back oh, yeah, I forgot. We have feats, too.
Uh, torches, beds. No, we don't have a lot. They must have put vermilion archery <laughs> as well as magic. That's free. This is also part of the mod set. Uh, those are free too. Oh wow, they definitely been adding in a lot more costumes or uh, accessories and skins and stuff. Like some of these look really dope. More religion stuff. Uh, villagers. Oh, so I have my own um, own stuff. Ah, so this is how we're going to make our uh, staffs again in case they break. Now let's get this first. Then we'll get this. Then our faction stuff starts to go up and up. Use stronger ones. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, I can get the armor too. The fashion is a thing, so I can wear like other things. It should be zero, right? Okay, I have them. Okay. They just didn't turn green. That's that's the thing that threw me off. Then there's kinky armor. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Gotta get them views, bro. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Okay, I did those. Did that count? Let's go see. Welcome Wish there was like a big quest complete, you know. Oh, I have to actually have those. Uh, it's a good thing I have a mod that allows me to pick up things that I placed. <laughs> uh, that was actually suggested. So that's perfect. So even if you craft it, you know, they the quest doesn't stay at that exact same uh thing. What is it? Alright, there we go. Be careful out there. There is a presence here. One that I have not felt. Oh. Okay, so uh now we're doing our fa oh what the fuck? Welcome to the Order of Elvenor, young Yeah, I couldn't do this I'm Theron Because it was like, ah, dude, you you can't do your faction quest first. Well, you can't do your faction quest until you're done with the tutorial. I'm thinking that's the tutorial done. Yep. Okay, so now we're doing our faction quest. Uh, you're now ready to begin your faction quest. These quests consider... Oh. Are considered main quests and will be unique to your selected faction following uh quest lines for your faction you're you'll be able to unlock rewards uh oh okay so side oh sub factions as well for a mage, time equals so power. there's so the game has a duplicating problem problem if you get too far away and come back on the map i mean like just say, what <laughs> anyhow um yeah quest g3 somewhere around g3 somewhere in this area i'm pretty sure it's right here because i think i ran over it to that area but uh we're gonna do that in the next episode <laughs> hopefully we'll all actually start building a house too on that episode Probably had that done. Uh, with that said, hope you all enjoyed. Um, well, that's if the series take off. If the series takes off, then I'll start building a house and I'll be like, boom, there's my crib. Hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> uh, yeah, it didn't. Hope you all enjoy it. Leave a like if you guys want me to actually begin the series now or wait until Ghostwire. Uh, either way it goes. Uh, it didn't. Peace out.